Hey everyone, it's your XOXO Claudia Fidgets, and today let's go through how I made this cardboard DIY inspired by the Sol de Janeiro spray. If you're new to my channel, I'm XOXO Claudia Fidgets, and everything in the background are all handmade by me using cardboard with recycled materials, and I do have tutorials posted on my channel. So without further ado, let's get right into the tutorial. To start off, these are everything we'll be using. We have cardboard, tape, paper, color paper, stuffing, paper roller, markers, and scissors. And feel free to pause in the next clip for some alternatives. And now I'm just going to start off by trimming my color paper and all the measurements will be linked in the description box. And now I'll just take the cardboard and glue on the paper. You can use tape or glue stick for this part. And I just cut it out. So now this paper will hold its shape better. And now I'll just be drawing on the label. For this, I'll be using a paint pen, but you can also feel free to use markers or a normal pen. And now it's time to draw it. Now I'll just wait for the ink to dry and I'll cover it with some tape. So here it is. And now I'll just take a color paper and draw a circle on it. And repeat the same step and glue it on a cardboard. So here it is, and I cut it out and also taped over it. And now this will be the base of the container, so you want to place it down and wrap this around. And just tape it or hot glue it all together. And here's mine after taping everything all together. And now I'll just take another circle that is the same as the base and glue it on top. And here it is. And now I'm going to take a sheet of paper, cut it into a strip, and I also covered it with cardboard and tape. And now I'll make two more, and again, all the measurements will be in the description box. Alright, so these are the three pieces, and they're all covered with cardboard and tape. And I'll begin by rolling them all together. And now these are all the three rings, and we'll just begin by gluing the first one on top of here. So here is mine, and you can use hot glue or tape. And now I just cut out a circle the same size as this hole, and glue it on top. Here is how it looks like. And now you want to take the second circle and glue that on top too. And here it is. And now it's time to take the last piece. This part is optional, but I'm just going to cut the top part here diagonally. But if you don't want to do this part, you can just take a circle and glue it on top. So here is my noun after trimming it. And now I just take a circle the same size as the top, folding it a little bit and gluing that on top. And here's mine after gluing the pieces all together. I'm now going to take this container, place in some stuffing, and take this top piece, cover the back hole with a piece of cardboard. And now here's how the back looks like with the cardboard. And you just want to place that on top. Now the container will look something like this. And now I'll just draw a little dot here for the spray bottle. And here it is. To start off and make the lid part, I'm going to be using a paper roll. And you can also feel free to make your own roll out of cardboard. I'm now going to trim it. Here it is. And I'm just going to cover it with some paper. And I also cut out a circle to glue on top. And here it is. I'm going to draw a label on the lid, but this part is optional. And here it is. Alright, and now we have just finished making everything, and let's put the lid on top. And here's the end product. And anyways, I hope you guys all had an amazing day or night, and I hope you had fun if you made one along through this video. But anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching, and make sure to subscribe if you haven't, because I will be doing a face reveal once we hit 1 million. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!